Hi folks, this is Greg with Best Choice Trailers. Today we're going to take a walk around this Load Trail 102 by 40 gooseneck car hauler from Load Trail. This unit's going to weigh in at about 7,500 pounds. It's going to give a net legal payload of about 13.5 plus your tongue weight. Tongue weight's going to equate to about 25%, give or take, depending on how it's loaded. This unit's got your gooseneck cold weather wiring harness. It's got your adjustable neck with your set bolts. Cold weather wire harness on a nice warm uh, 15 degree day like today would certainly be nice. It stays flexible. You've got your pinstriping on the neck which is typical uh, load trail styling. They also do the neck gussets going from the vertical to the horizontal and then also going from the vertical to the side rail. Gives some strength to that uh, neck area. Dual jacks are standard equipment. It's got a full front toolbox with greasers on the box. It's got a split lid. Inside here you'll see the Dexter electric hydraulic actuator. This unit is equipped with disc brakes. You'll also notice there a Ford Chevy adapter. So some trucks don't work with electric hydraulic on the integrated controllers. Uh, that system there will allow that to, uh, to work. Before I slide back here too far, I'll also show you this unit's got a winch plate built into the neck. And up top there, uh, there's also a spare tire in the neck that would come with this unit. You'll notice all the wiring's ran in the neck and it's all protected and uh, clipped back to the, to the sides here. 2x8 pressure treated decking standard, 16 inch uh, on center, structural 3 inch channel cross members. It's got a 10 inch channel mainframe with a 3 by 5 inch uh, underframe bridge. You'll notice it's bridged with 3 by 5 underneath the 10 inch channel. Also the side rail on this, uh, where we see some differentiation among manufacturers, this is built out of 8 inch channel uh, where a lot in the industry, or some in the industry anyway, are going to come off the mainframe and come out with a fab part. Uh, instead of that structural out there. So this is uh, a structural side rail, uh, certainly a, a heavy duty setup. You got uh, a rub rail with stake pockets and then you've got your paint chain or pipe spool in between. Unit is powder coated with Sherwin Williams powder coat. It's got all LED lights with a sealed wiring harness. On the 102s, we've done the drive over fenders on these. Dexter brand axles, 7,000 pound with the new Ford adjusting brakes. And this also has the easy lube hubs behind the black cap. Gladiator tires, 235 80R16. It's got the slipper spring suspension. You'll notice they also do the gusseting uh, on the drive overs. They also build it out of uh, a lot heavier material. You'll notice on these drive overs, you get a nice low uh, approach angle. It's got the extended beaver tail. This one's also got the swivel support stands. And on this one we've also lengthened the ramps. This has a dump trailer style ramp. They're about seven foot instead of a traditional five foot car hauler style ramp. And these are a rear slide in. Something like this would be ideal for a pair of mud trucks. Uh, certainly, most any combination of two trucks would be ideal for something like this. Uh, you can get three smaller cars. Certainly, we have guys that haul UTVs, ATVs, equipment, all kinds of stuff. Uh, air conditioners, uh, big cars air conditioners, and whatnot. So, big trail like this. Uh, ideal unit sits lower than your deck over. It's going to weigh just a hair lower than a deck over. Got your black powder coat with your black powder coated wheels. Nice looking trailer. So it's a Load Trail GB21 model. Again, it's a 40 foot. If you have any questions on this or any of our other trailers, feel free to give us a ring at 717 220 4220 or visit us on the web at bestchoicetrailers.com.